Hello friends, welcome back to my channel, I'm Melissa. So I have some new bookish stuff that I wanna share with you guys because I am really excited about this stuff. So I have to do this real quick because my boys will be home in like 20 minutes. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you everything real quick. Um, so I got some, uh, a few items from Lit Joy Crate and then also from Enchanted Phantom, which I do have a coupon code for Enchanted Phantom if you want to check out their their Etsy shop as well as their uh, website. Um, it can save you a little bit of money off um, their items. They have some really cute shirts that I ordered and I'm so excited to share them with you. So let's get into these. I'm going to share them with you real quick. So the first one I actually got from Lit Joy Crate. It said, I closed my book to be here, and it's beautiful. I love, like, big, huge sweatshirts, so I'm definitely going to enjoy that one. <sighs> the next three are from Enchanted Phantom. Um, you can find these one on their Etsy shop if you want to go ahead and purchase these for yourself. Um, so, look at this beauty. Ah, peace, love books. I love it. I love huge oversized sweatshirts, and this one is so nice. I wish it wasn't white, but that's okay. I still absolutely love it, and yeah. I can't wait to wear it. And then the next one is this beauty. It says, smells like the book fair sometime in the, in the 90s. I'm totally a 90s girl, so this is absolutely adorable. Love it. I can't wait to wear this one as well and then the last one i got book dragon love it love it definitely a book dragon. so this next one is pins i've already opened these i already seen them they're gorgeous i just i'm in love so this is the first one absolutely love this one so gorgeous this one's from blissfully bookish and so stunning. I love this. I'm so excited to add it to my Akatar collection because, yes, I have an Akatar collection. And then I got these two from Ali Palmer Art. And they they actually had these on clearance. I think I paid like $2.50 for this one and like $3.50 for this one. But these were like their fall ones. And this is like little Dobby with little pumpkins. Look at his little socks on. So cute. And then we have Hagrid with a floating pumpkin. So cute. I love these. Definitely going on my Harry Potter pin board. Um, now let's get into the big box. This one I have not opened. I know what it is because I had enough credits saved up that I actually got all of this for, for free. I just had to pay for shipping. Um, so I'm so excited. And these are sold out on the website. You cannot get them anymore. So, ooh, I'm so happy. So, this is, um, this is a Holly Black collection. This is a mug, I believe. And the box is really pretty. It's kind of got all different kind of designs on it. So, it says, two scheming great schemes. So, let's open this one up. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, this is so cute. This is adorable. Oh my gosh, look how cute that is. <gasps> Beautiful. Okay, and then gotta put the top on. Let me get off of here. It's a mushroom. Oh my gosh. I am in love with this. So cute. It's probably just going to like sit on my bookshelf somewhere, to be honest with you. I love it. It's beautiful. Okay. Let's get into the next thing, which I haven't decided where I'm going to put it yet. Um, so I got to find a spot for it somewhere. Okay. This is the next item in a plain box. Oh, 
so nice. So satisfied. Oh my gosh, this is stunning. So this is the Cruel Prince uh, bookshelf alley. And it has like a little light. I cannot wait to plug this in and find a spot for it on my bookshelf. So gorgeous. I love it. Ah! So anyways, that was everything that I got in this bookish unboxing. I do have some more items coming on the way. I may have went on a little shopping spree. My birthday's coming up, so I kind of just decided to splurge on myself and spoil myself for a little bit. Um, I don't do it very often, but every once in a while, I get the urge to spoil myself. So that's what I did. I did spoil myself. Um... But that is all I have. Uh, like I said, if you are interested in Enchanted Fandom and any of those shirts, I will link it down below for you guys to go and check out. Um, also, I'll link um, the other companies that I got these from. I'll link those down below too. So if you guys want to go shop there as well. I don't have any coupons codes for them. Just Enchanted Fandoms. But they have such cute stuff. Definitely recommend going and checking out if, uh, if this is something you're interested in. Hello friends. So I decided I'm going to add part two to this video. Um, so if you're watching this, I actually got some more book mail and I really want to share with you what I, what I got. So I'm sitting on my floor so you may see the baby. So I am really excited. I had placed an order with Lit Joy Crate and I got some bookish goodies that I've been kind of wanting and I just kind of saved up my money and I thought, you know what, I'm going to spoil myself birthday's coming up so figured why not um i don't do this very often let me tell you but i also want to show you guys a shirt i got this shirt from enchanted fandoms love it smells like the book fair sometime in the 90s um i do have a coupon code for enchanted fandoms link it down below but i think you've already seen this shirt in the first half of this video so yeah so let's get into this box um First thing is I got the Lunicorn wallet. And look at the little Spectra specs. I am really excited. I needed a new wallet, so. So yeah, so I totally got that one. I'm gonna play with, play with that. I also decided to pick up this. Um, it's the, uh, it's the little travel bag that matches my other travel bag. Um, so I wanted to get it because I have the other one. And so this would be perfect for like all my other little stuff. Um, so it's the, um, it's not Bellatrix. No, it's, I can't think of the, I can't think of the other school, the, with floor. Floor's school. I can't think what the name of it is. Um, anyway, so it's that school. I have the other um, expandable one. I'll try to add a picture so you can see which what I'm talking about. I use it for trips, but since I'm going to Pennsylvania in a month, I, well, not in a month, uh, Pennsylvania for a month, I thought this would be perfect for carrying other things like my medicine and other things in it. So I picked this one up. And I picked up the Critter sticker sheet because it's got like all the sticker. Like I have a couple, I have quite a few of these pins. Um, some of them I don't have, but I have quite a few of these pins. So I, I love stickers. Then, oh, I got this artwork. Actually, I think this came with my, um, uh, Aquatar. Uh, collection that I got. I'm super excited about that, but look how pretty this artwork is. I got this box. Can't remember what all I purchased. Oh, this is actually a gift for Becca. So I really don't want to... Oh, wow, it's actually really nice. Okay, I'm going to share it with you guys, so hopefully Becca doesn't see this, but it's this little police box fairy door but you like open it and it's like the TARDIS inside the TARDIS I think this is gorgeous it's actually a lot heavier than I thought um so yeah that's actually a birthday present for Becca so let's hope Becca doesn't watch this video she doesn't really have much time to watch my videos 
um, because she's actually in school now. She's studying to be an English teacher. So, um, so yeah, hopefully she doesn't see this video, but that's her birthday present. Okay. I'll show you this last, but look at this box. See Sarah J. Mass on it. I'm going to show you this last, but I'm going to show you the last little bit. So I did get the book sleeve. Wow. This thing is huge. Um, I thought it was smaller than that, but I think I got the large size. It's huge. It's perfect for taking a book. I love that it has a zipper on it. This is actually going to fit my iPad. This is going to be nice for taking along with me. I can put my iPad in here and for trips and stuff. Oh, I love this artwork. This is by Rosie Thorne, I think. I love her artwork. So beautiful. Oh, I'm so happy. So happy. And then I also got Bridgerton uh, chapstick. This is actually Little Lady Whistledown Society paper, and it's lemonade. It smells like lemonade. Let's give it a go. Are you getting a bubble? Mmm. It's really nice. Really nice job. And I also got some other stickers. Um, I'll show you them. I am going to add some of these to my cups. <laughs> there's a Lit Joy one. And there's a Just One More Page. Uh, Fantasy Reader, which I love. Sci-fi reader, so true. And then it says introvert, but willing to talk books because that's exactly what I am. I'm an introvert. So I'm super excited about those. I'm gonna set those up there. And then can I have this? And then I got a pin. Is anybody shocked? I got a pin for my pin collection. This is a Braxos from the Throne of Glass series. Look how pretty he is. Super cute. Oh, I love him. Beautiful. He's got his little flowers because he loves flowers. I I love it. Um, I'm excited to add it to my collection. Okay, guys. It's time to get into this. So there's like a ribbon here, but I think. Oh, yeah. So you open the top and they can like stand. This does not want to stay open. But you can open the top. And then in here... You open, open it, and there's, like, so this was for Christmas, and there's, like, I think, like, 12 of them in here, but they each have, like, a number on them, so I'm going to share this with you. Okay, so let's look at the first one. These are all acrylic stand, standees. Ho, 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 that is beautiful. I think this... I think that's Armitha. And they're from the Akatar series. I think there's a layer of plastic over it, but I'll just show you. I think this one is Armitha. Armithan? Armitha? Two. I wanted to get these for Christmas, but I didn't have the money then, so I had to wait and save up my money. So, uh, no, no, no. And I was so happy that they still had some available. Okay. I believe this one is the High Lord himself. Hey, like, look at that artwork. Stunning. Let's check out number three. Here is Tamlin. Tamlin the Tool. There he is. Very cool. And here is Fair Darling. Very pretty. The High Lady herself. All right. This one, I believe, is Amarin. I think this one's actually Amarin. I think that one might be Nesta. Okay, this one's more. Look how beautiful she is. Very much her. Beautiful. Okay, this one's Elaine. Look how beautiful she is. So, like, perfect depiction of Elaine. Okay, here's the Sorrel. Oh my goodness, look how, look how cool. All right, here's Cassian. Look how very handsome he looks. No, Jesse. Sorry, this one is actually Lucian, not 
Cassian. This one's Lucian. I remember now. Okay, here's Azriel. So pretty. And then this one must be Cassian. Better be Cassian. Yep. It's and here is Cassian. Cal. So cool. Love these. Love them. All right. There you have them all. I love that it has a little drawer so you can like store them in. And it has like the little night court scene. I think that's really a nice touch. Um, I absolutely love this. Now I gotta find a special place to put all these. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm loving it. Um, but that is everything that I have in this unboxing. I have something else coming in the mail. I don't know when it's gonna get here. So um so I'm not sure if I'm going to add more to this video or not. I'll have to look and see. But, um, yeah, I'll have to look and see uh, if I want to add any more to this video. But for right now, this is what I got today. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm going to go, and I guess if there's more, there will be more. If not, um, I'll close it out in the next clip. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys. Hi guys, welcome back. So this is the last clip of this video. I have some more mail. Um, so this is the last thing that I've gotten for a while. So um, I wanted to include it because it is stunning. Um, so actually it's uh, two different items I got in the mail. One I got yesterday. And I... Uh, Actually, one of my subscribers reached out to me. Her name's Monica. So, Monica, if you're watching this, thank you so much again. Um, she asked me if I would be interested in any of her pins that she had for sale. And I said I'd definitely check them out and look at them. She had one that I was interested in. Some of the other ones I already had or I just wasn't um, interested in them. But the one that she had that I was interested in was actually a book that I just finished, um, Sorcery of Thorns. Um, so I picked up this beauty. It says Child of the Library. It has a cat and it's really, really pretty. I love it. Um, so she, I got this from her and then she also included a little special extra something. Um, a pin banner. This is from Owlcrate. Um, but it's just like plain black. It's perfect. I love it. I've been needing like some, some more space for pins so I'm definitely going to use this I'm not sure where I'm going to hang it yet but I'm going to find your space and and use it and I'll probably put this pin on it for sure because it just it works but I'm so happy to have both of these so thank you very much Monica I really do appreciate you sending these and I did purchase this from her just so you know and this was a little gift from her so thank you very much um, so the last thing I have to share with you, I did purchase another one of these fictional flames from Blissfully Bookish Tees, and this one is Jude and Carden, and it is absolutely beautiful. I love that they've got his like tail in there and everything, so it is beautiful, absolutely gorgeous, and I'm so glad to have this in my collection. I just have to figure out where I'm going to put both of them because they're very, very large and I have a little bit of, not very much room, I should say. Um, but I absolutely love this. It actually goes really well. I got my, my Cruel Prince bookshelf. I rearranged my bookshelves. I added some of my new items. Um, so I had to find a spot to add some of my new items so there's that and then I only added a few but I got the box up there so I can add more if I wanted to so but anyways that is definitely it for this video hi friends Edit and Melissa here so I actually did get one more package I actually got it on Saturday so I haven't had a chance to show you until now I'm working on this video and I for totally forgot about it um, but I got two pins from Dreamy & Co. And I absolutely love them. 
Um, so this is their Polaroid series, and this is Valaris. I think it's beautiful. I'm sorry if you can hear the kids in the background. They got home from school and they're wild. But it's beautiful. And then I also picked up Elfame. Um, this is from the Cruel Print series. I love these pins and so happy to add them to my collection. Um, I love enamel pins, so definitely glad to add it to my collection. Anyways, that's all I have. So back to your regular, regular scheduled video. Um, that's all like the little bookish goodies I have purchased lately. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, let me know down in the comments what was your favorite item. I have way too many things that I just got that I cannot tell you a favorite. Um, but definitely hit me up in the comments down below. Um, that is all I have for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.